Hey Mini Enthusiasts, how are you doing? So I'm back once again this weekend, so special treat, another video. Uh, in this one I am just putting up some photos of an old uh, classic mini winter workshop. So this was back in 2013 when I first got Vinny. Uh, it looked very, very different back then. As I said in previous videos, uh, Vinny came, uh, Vinny was an eBay purchase, uh, all the grand sum of 990 pounds uh, when I got it it was uh, it wasn't bad actually it was reasonably tidy what you know what can you expect for that sort of money the scuttle panel on it though was really really rusty um, so that was one of the first things I'd done so in a moment I'll show you some photos of when I'd done the scuttle panel uh, and there's some before and after shots as well of the car as it is now and back when it was in 2013. So the more observant of you and if you're looking for continuity will notice some of the last photos in this montage where it shows uh, the scuttle panel being painted are new. Uh, photos or newer than when the skull panel was replaced uh, that's because in 2016 I was doing some work on the mini bleeding out the clutch I spilt some brake fluid on the scuttle panel um, couldn't wipe it off quick enough being cellulose paint it uh, took the paint off unfortunately so I had to get a bit of a respray back then and just a couple of other points to note um, the scuttle panel I fitted was a non-genuine panel um, it was about half the price of a genuine panel to be honest it fitted pretty well uh, seeing it was non-genuine didn't really have too much trouble uh, I, I did notice though the non-genuine panels don't come up as far up the windscreen pillar by about uh, by about probably two to three inches um, so if it's if you've got a scuttle panel that's rustier further up uh, you even need to get a, a full scuttle and windscreen surround or uh, if you get a genuine heritage one, they're, they're sl they, they go further up the windscreen panel, so it might be easier to fit. Um, and also, just a, again, just a point to note, um, the scuttle panel is not always that easy to replace in situ, especially if the, w the wing's been welded to it or something like that. Uh, fortunately, in this case, the scuttle panel was so rusty, uh, it pretty much just fell off the car. Uh, and I was managed to, I had to put a new closing panel on there. Uh, as you'd have seen, as you see in the photos, the closing panel was almost non-existent. Uh, I managed to do that from on top, uh, slide the scuttle panel in, uh, and then just get underneath and tack weld it from underneath. 